A pleasure to meet y'all at last. And so right now, today, it is July 22nd. And it's my honor to finally reintroduce Gaming with Kaiju Force Neo Face Cam Specials Insurgents. It has been at least six months since the last time I did this. And so now, coming back to that, I actually feel much better to say that now I'm going to get more episodes in this mini-series involved. And, without really going into action or cutting into any contradictions that could pretty much potentially draw out any spoilers, I'm just going to go right on ahead. And, I'm going to put these on here because these aren't really comparable to the PlayStation 4 mic that I would normally use, but right now, the game we're playing is called Doom. And the 2016 version, this is what it is. So, what I do first is I'm just gonna lay out adjustments to it, including brightness. Because why not? And you probably haven't really noticed I'm not actually just playing this. This is not like on live stuff. So this is actually footage I pre recorded, and wow. You'll probably get the rest of it from there. But, I'm going to go and select, not from Ultra Nightmare, because that would be way too hard. Probably Hurt Me Plenty would be good enough. Or what you can see here. I'm going to select Hurt Me Plenty right here in just a moment. It does have a pretty good variety of difficulties. So I can't imagine, really anything else besides the fact that this version of Doom here being that it's a rebooted version of the franchise it's no doubt got plenty of options for you to choose from so it's gonna begin at some point so I'm gonna see within a moment here what we're gonna have now I have played this game before so it's pretty much no surprise and I'm pretty much just well revitalizing the story. I have played this story mode at least a couple times. So it's probably no surprise that I'm finally getting back onto that. But you Alright, looks like we're ready to go here. And I've got no controller in my hands. I'm still you know watching the footage over and over again. Yes, of course, I mean I did play this game before on Gaming with Kaiju Force Neo and I uploaded it to my channel, so you could already see episodes of me playing this. Oh, yeah, of course, looking back at the story from, yeah, oh yeah, see it right there. I mean, the ESRB isn't even joking anymore. They're really serious about getting these games rated the way they're supposed to. So, of course I'm just starting off here with a pistol, because why wouldn't you want to start from some point in time with a small weapon like this? And I do feel glad that this pistol here does have unlimited ammo. Of course, I'm going to act as this door right here. We have to contain this. Hologram of Olivia Pierce, who... Is probably someone that you'll get to know later on in the game. I mean, for those who have already played this version of Doom, you'd probably know better about it by now. Especially if you keep playing the story mode over and over again. But, yeah. I just had to pause it here because I was trying to take a little break. As I was already recording a lot of footage from some other games. I was spending too much time sitting down, so of course this is what's happening. And look, back in the action. Because I'm just that desperate to pretty much get any other clips I can. Of course, the Doom guy is putting on the Praetor suit. There we go. There's the helmet. Yeah. I mean, if you haven't seen the EF3 gameplay videos for Doom Eternal, which will be coming out this November, then you would know 
that it does start off similar to this where you put the helmet on and yeah. I just can't wait for that game to come out to be honest it's gonna be really fun compared to this from what I've seen though this version of Doom here is also pretty nice welcome yeah I'm Dr. Samuel Hayden. I'm the head of this facility. Yeah, I just had to take one of the earbuds out so I would have been able to in a way that comprehend what both. the tone I was talking. There's Samuel Hayden. And, of course, you can see here that these face cam specials and surgeons episodes are also a bit shorter than most. But that's only because I'm trying to make some of my videos more shareable so this way if i were to say like upload a link towards twitter let's say towards either of my twitter accounts then of course you'd know that my videos right there would be online and you'd be able to watch them just by clicking on the link to them there we go pick up the combat shotgun and i'm gonna walk in some more rooms with the demons inside. And there's the introduction of the imp right there. Shoot him with the shotgun. There we go. I keep moving on here towards the other rooms. And there's a gore nest right there. Those are the unwillings. They're kind of like zombies. And there we go. The gore nest is going to explode. Oh crap. Yeah, right there, I died. I just died on the spot. So, it's gonna reload again, but again, I'm just relapsing footage that I previously recorded, so I'm not actually playing the game, I'm just pretty much reacting to my own footage that I recorded some time ago, even. Because most of my footage is pretty old, so I'm, I guess I could start using the older footage instead of just moving on to the newer one so this way I'm able to get a good grip on what the old footage has even though the new footage does showcase some more skills that I've obtained but playing more games getting more experience out of them yeah I keep using the pistol in there switching to this combat shotgun occasionally getting some good glory kills out of them too all of these unwilling. There's two more that are still blinking. And I kill them all with glory kills. Look at it. Get rid of the gore nest. And, I mean, wow. This is just crazy. I'm probably going to have to zoom in a little bit just to keep track of how much time I have left. But, there's more demons showing up. <laughs> or at least it's what I see here. So, alright. When I'm talking about the same Zoom, I'm talking about the timeline mode on my video editor software, which specifically it's known as Vegas Movie Studio Platinum. Let's see. Demonic threat might be over already. Nope, there's still one more imp. There's two more? Okay. Oh, geez. where did we go? Oh, it went up there. Yeah, I'm pretty low on ammo already. Oh, there's more imps. Like, they just keep spawning in as soon as I kill the other ones. So. Just. Well, this is a whole new one. For, oh, look at that. Another glory kill. Takes place. <laughs> I'm so into this game for sure. I mean, this is a game I can play over and over again. Any day. So, of course, 13 and a half minutes would probably be the best way for me to go with these Space Camp Specials Insurgents episodes. At least for this season of this mini-series. I mean, I probably will do Face Camp Specials Insurgents only once a year, just like I did with the last season. There were only nine episodes involved, but yet I was able to get some pretty good footage out of all of them. Only nine episodes over the course of about a whole month throughout the rest of December 2018 and eventually rolling on to January 2019. But here in July, and probably through August too, I'm probably going to have some more of this take place. Right there, 
at the elevator. Samuel Hayden talks to me again. Oh, look at that. Just straight up smashes the control and introduces the title screen. And look at that. That's just right there. This is a reboot that's meant to entertain us, Doom fans. And I am a pretty big Doom fan for the most part, just because of this franchise. I mean, the last Doom game that I had was Doom BFG from 2007. It's almost like, well, the graphics of that game are almost comparable to what Doom 3 had, but Doom BFG was the only game that we had after Doom 3, and now we have this. And eventually, later this year, we're going to have Doom Eternal, which is coming around November. So, that's going to be a pretty good time for us. We're going to have some more Doom games coming in. I'll sure as heck buy Doom Eternal with what I'll be able to get. Of course, this part was a bit hard for me at first. Right there. I've got low health already just by you know, kind of waltzing into the fireball attacks. Looks like... there we go. And there's another demon that gets turned in. I kind of forgot the name of it. But I know the unwilling come first and then the imps come second. The imps are what shoot the fireballs at you. They're pretty fast moving. And then there are the third type of demons. I just don't seem to know what the name to them are. And I'm firing at one right now. There we go. So more unwilling and more imps are coming in, but of course with the combat shotgun it takes only one hit to kill one of the imps. It takes a few more to kill any of those other ones. But it's pretty easy to kill the unwilling with the combat shotgun or with a fully charged shot from the pistol. go one shot one kill and there you go splattered into pieces oh. keep firing pistol shots towards the imp glory kill there we go yep now it's dead so of course when I also played this par for the first time I could not really notice but as soon as I got to the door I had no idea I needed a key card for it, but I did have a bit of a hard time finding out where the blue key card is. Yeah, requires an access card from a blue card, of course. This is the part where I have to go to to obtain the blue card. Get it from this corpse here. The blue card is just attached to the vest. And there we go. All I have to do now is to just walk up to the door. That's how I learned it the first time I played this. And yeah, there's the introduction of the frag grenade. So, of course, there are going to be some more things that we'll eventually notice here. Because this is the third time I played the story mode on this. But it's still pretty fun. I'm going to zoom in even more because I really am starting to have a bit of trouble tracking down. And so what we have here, we got some more action that takes place. And we're also going to have some more face cam specials and surgeons episodes come in. But I feel like this is going to be a really good start right here. But if you want to see more, go down to my channel. Make sure that you like, subscribe, comment, follow me on social media, and stay on the Hollywood side.